aquí está presente para nosotros a Blanco Oro. Sí. Ok, dímelo. Estamos activos. I was born and raised in Ecuador, Guayaquil. En 1993 decidimos venirnos a vivir a Canadá gracias a la oportunidad que nos dio nuestra hermana mayor Elvira Sánchez de Malitsky, quien nos ofreció trabajo y vivienda hasta que podíamos conseguir nuestra casa. When I was like around eight years old, my parents decided that we should like you know move to Canada to have a better future, better education, you know all that so I remember just moving into my aunt's house in Toronto just meeting my family and uh, it, was, it was crazy man uh, I had a cousin named Karam and he had a band he used to always jam with the band downstairs in the basement and I remember me and my family moved into the basement in this like one room it was like five family members in one room and my dad used to play guitar and always sing and stuff like that and he always used to like um, interview people he worked for like TLN for a bit and he was interviewing all the like Latin artists um, in the city, you know. And uh, he always used to take me to the studio. So I was always like brought up in music and stuff like that. So from a young age, I was always into music. My dad was like kind of poor. My mom was middle class, but love kept them together. You know what I'm saying? We always used to go to the beach like every weekend, you know, with my dad. He used to play like crazy music like Jose Jose and stuff like that, romantic music. And like I always remember those times going to the beach, my dad used to go fishing, we used to go boogie boarding and everything. So we we're always active man. Me and my brother did crazy shit man, like I got stitches and shit, like so many times and shit, just like trying to do crazy shit, like riding a bike for the first time, smashed into a wall, handlebars hit my chin, got stitches. Tu papá, Javier, y yo tratamos de darles la mejor vida posible y la mejor educación en especial. Juan José de Niño tenía problemas de aprendizaje que le afectó mucho, pero tratamos de hacer lo mejor para él y lo pusimos en clases privadas en la casa y en un colegio muy reconocido en Ecuador. Les gustaba pintar y Juan José la música. Desde muy pequeño le ha encantado la música. Rides, attractions, an authentic Latin marketplace, and hot Latin music all day long. It's Latin Fest 2009, Saturday, August 15th at Canada's Wonderland, featuring hip hop stars Blanco Oro and Gabby Boy. My, my dad and mom put me in the modeling and uh, just uh, doing like movie roles, like behind the scenes, like background acting and stuff like that, just extras and stuff. I was uh, skateboarding in the background of uh, It Takes Two. I was in the background there of Kung Fu The Legend Continues, uh, and also like a show called Goosebumps and I was in a show called Blossom and a lot of different things and I did modeling for a lot of different um, companies too like Levi's and Converse and I was in all these different malls and catalogs and stuff like that.